If you've been following me for a while, then you know that my curls used to be this popping. Yes, my natural hair was this full and beautiful, and the curls were so defined, and the length was there. And then this happened. I had my daughter, baby favorite. She came into this world and snatched my hair right on up, okay? For a minute, my hair still was the same. The curls were there, the length was there. And then after a while, things just started to windle away. Like things just started to thin out a whole lot. And then one day I woke up and my edges were gone, literally. Like the edges were gone. I had no edges. And then my hair just started to shed and shed and shed and that postpartum shedding did not stop because till this day, my hair is still shedding. So in today's video, I'm just gonna show you guys what I've been doing to try and get these curls back as you can see in this video. There's no length, there's no fullness, the curls are not defined. Now, I only straighten my hair when I'm getting a trim. That's the only time. It's like once in a blue moon. But for the most part, my hair stays natural. I've been going natural for years now. Um, so this is one of those days where I went and got a trim. Now I'm ready for my hair to be back natural. So I'm just gonna wash my hair, condition my hair. I'm using Pantene's Complete Curl Care Shampoo and Conditioner. Now, this video is not sponsored by Pantene. However, I did do some e-com videos uh, for this collection when it first dropped. So you guys may see me all over the internet, you know, using these products. I was able to test out the products when I completed some ecom videos for pantene and i have not stopped using it ever since because <laughs> this shampoo and conditioner is everything i really feel like it's been helping with um the definition of my curls and defining my curls and just rehydrating my hair in general it's been working really really well so i'll have um links to complete curl care in my description box you can literally get it from like Target, Walmart, Amazon, literally anywhere, but I've been loving it, so I decided to share. And um, y'all already know I'm going in with that aloe vera. Also, if you've been watching me, you know that I love me some aloe vera gel. It's really hard to find natural aloe vera gel in store, like 100% natural, 100% organic, it's hard. So I've gotten back into buying the aloe vera plant and just applying it to my hair on a weekly basis. So that's what I've been doing to hydrate my hair, to get my curls back defined and luscious. It also helps with hair growth. Um, so this is like my curl secret. And I just remember, you know, when my hair was at its best, I was using aloe vera gel a whole lot. It was like in my daily hair care routine. So I'm back and I'm better, okay? I'm back to my normal routine. I'm back taking care of these curls because I really just want my hair to just get back to its normal self again. Now what I normally do is just make sure I get the aloe vera plant nice and juicy by poking holes in it and then I just basically use the the plant like a sponge and just rub it throughout my scalp and my entire head and make sure I drench my hair with the aloe vera gel. And then I'm going to twist my hair down and put a shower cap on, let it sit on for about 10 minutes and rinse the aloe vera gel out. Now this is optional. You can rinse it out or you can leave it in your hair. So it really just depends on the day. Some days I rinse it out, some days I leave it in the hair. It really just depends on if it's a good curl day or not. Now today is one of those days I probably should have left it on because you guys are gonna see when I comb my hair out, because it was just straight, it does look very stringy, but believe me, honey, I do not have heat damage, okay? I do not straighten my hair enough to have heat damage. My hair literally probably gets straightened maybe three times a year. So, yeah. So this is what I do. I literally just take my finger and then I, you know, start to define my curls 
And this is just what I have to do on a daily basis. I have to keep trying to define them with my fingers and basically just retrain them, retrain them so that they know this is how you're supposed to be. This is how you're supposed to look, okay?